squeaky talk. Please. I'm sorry, but I just can't tell you about our wonderful Saturday surprise until everyone is here, and that includes TJ. I wish TJ would just show already. This is driving me nuts. Here he comes. Guys, guys, guess what we're doing Saturday? Going to visit senior citizens. Good one, Mikey. But no, we're going to the Senior Fusion Fest at the mall. Oh man, TJ, you serious? SF himself is going to be there, signing trading cards and any flat surface you bring. Oh, wow. wow! But I made an appointment this Saturday for us to share our youth with those less youthful at the Red Bib Denerson Center for the Extremely Mature. Sorry, Mikey, but if the choice is Senior Fusion or an old folks home, the guy in the Matador getup wins every time. Perhaps we could visit the old folks home some other Saturday. But I promised I'd arrive with five friends this Saturday. Um, maybe you can find five other friends. Or maybe I can find a way to convince the five friends I already have. Give me liberty or give me death. Powerful, powerful words. And now, let's take ten minutes to discuss your history project with your partners. I suspect a little trip to the library will provide the required historical data. Hey, eh, Mikey? Maybe, but a little visit to the Danderson Center this Saturday would provide real live historical data. While that's true, I believe we could easily extrapolate most of that data from books and other secondary sources without having to miss the Senior Fusion Fest on Saturday. Oh. Come on, here, Mikey. Oh. Mikey, no! How many times do I have to say it? Oh, TJ, please think it over. These old people have experienced the most amazing things in their lifetimes. Mikey, the Fusion Fest is going to be one of the most amazing experiences in my lifetime. All right, that does it. No more Mr. Mike guy. Sitting in my rocking chair, looking to the door, I dream of someone standing there. I couldn't ask for more. Though now I'm old and getting round can sometimes cause a fuss. I know I'd like to have a friend. Maybe one name. Gus? Gee, I sort of know how they feel. Okay, when do we leave? Can you two imagine your grandparents all alone waiting for some youthful cheer? Don't go there, Mikey. Now imagine their sad faces when they hear you're not coming. <sighs> Grammy and Papa? Sad? Oh, man. Okay, Mikey, count me in. Thanks, Benelli. Not just from me, but from all those dear, sweet, older people who'll be overjoyed to see the three of us. Make it four. Hola, amigos. I come to you now with a majority. What? You guys gave in? Come on, guys. The Senior Fusion Fest is a once-in-a-lifetime happening. Is this fictional favorite of yours really more important than living, breathing people? Quit asking me hard questions, Mikey. Sorry to interrupt, but according to my calculations, we could fit in time for both on the same day. Oh, joy. I'll give it half an hour. We get in, we get out. Nobody gets bored. Here we are, about to begin the greatest Saturday ever. I can't wait to see the smiles on their faces when they see us. Go away! We don't want any! Well, we tried. Let's hit the Fusion Fest. Wait, friends. I'm sure it was just some misunderstanding. What do you want? Please, ma'am. I'm Mikey Blumberg. My friends and I are here for a visit. Oh, oh, youngins! Well, why didn't you say so before? I thought you were another salesman. Now, come in, come in. See, guys, we're going to have a wonderful time. Speaking of time, Gus, initiate stopwatch. Stopwatch initiate. 30 minutes and counting, Cheech. Let's do it. Everybody, the kid is supposed to sing for us and his little friends. <laughs> hey, come here, young fella. Hey, I saw him first. See how happy they are to have us here. Come on, boyo. We got a karaoke machine and everything. Have fun, guys. I'm sure I will. Come on, girly. You're with me. So, what do we do now? I don't know. Mingle? Morning. Uh, hi there. I'm TJ. I bet you are. I heard a bunch of you youngsters were coming. Kid, you know what's wrong with your generation. Uh... No direction. That's right. Kids today are playing unfocused. All you can really use a uniting cause, like our generation had in World War II. I'm George. Huh? And you look familiar. Oh, uh, no I don't! There's something about your face. My... my face? Hello, sir. I'm Gretchen Grudler. Oh, honey, there's no use chatting it up with Norris. See, he hasn't said a peep in years. Perhaps he's shy. Uh, how about this weather we've been having? Perhaps you'd like to point out how tough things were when you were my age. Uh, Streak, it's your move. Yeah, I know all you want, kid. Nobody ruins the Streak's rhythm. 
in through the front door, once around the back, peek through the window, and off jumps Jack. Keep it up and off jumps Finelli. The cat down ladies sing their song, do da, do da. Squares down, down kid, give us a break. Where'd we put oh, that hook we used during the talent show? I'm going around all night, I'm going around all night. Oh, 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 Somebody bet on the testing, one, two, testing. Microphone ain't the problem, Sonny, it's you. You stink. That certainly is a nice sweater you have on. I'm running out of topics. Perhaps you'd care to discuss the physics of subatomic particles. Now that I'm declassified, I'd be delighted. I happen to have been a prime mover on the Manhattan Project. You helped develop the weapon that ended World War II? But surely everyone here would love to hear your stories. Uh, most people here aren't stimulating enough to waste the diffusion of carbon dioxide. But you, you seem possessed of a mind. Oh, my. Well, thank you. Okay, okay. You see before. Just don't hurt me. Relax, little buddy. I wouldn't hurt you. You see, I know what it's like to be a little guy. Look it. Hey, that looks like me. So that's where I saw you. It was my mirror 75 years ago. But you're so big now. Is your daddy big and strong? Yeah, he's ginormous. Well, chances are you'll grow up to be just like him. You think so? Hey, Streak, is there a basketball hoop around this joint somewhere? This domino game moves too slow. It's all about concentration, which is what you gotta have when you're at bat, facing Satchel Paige in the show. What? You saying you used to play pro baseball? Used to bat cleanup back when Birmingham had a team. You played for Birmingham? They had some of the greatest players of all time. Who you telling? I played with all of them. Now take that Willie Mays kid now. This knitting stuff is for sissies. Mind if I flip on the tube so I can catch the wrestling? Go ahead if you like watching weaklings in tights, but their whips don't know nothing about real fighting. Boxing glove? Oh, just the lining. <laughs> Only reason I knit is to keep my wrists and forearms strong. Never know when some vacuum salesman won't take no for an answer. You gotta be kidding me. Merchant Marines never kids. You were a Merchant Marine? For 34 years. Boy, those were the days. Back when you could give a dirty double cross with the old one-two. And that's why there's nothing worth listening to on the radio these days. The tension with Finster might be more fun than this. Hmm. I remember when I was detained back in the war. There were these two crazy old officers that were always cracking down on us. Logan, you wouldn't have any idea what happened to the secret communique I received today, would you? Why no, Commandant Prickleton. Not at all. Have you asked the sergeant? Von Finstrom? Sir, I haven't seen it. In fact, I haven't seen a thing. <laughs> Logan! Wow, Mr. Rogan, that's way cooler than anything I would heard at the Senior Fusion Fest. Senior Fusion Fest? Oh, well, you see, he's a superhero you probably never heard of. The name sort of rings a bell. This him? Wait a minute! You, you're leaving Larry Rogan, the creator of Senior Fusion? Well, back in the day, we called him Senior Electricity. Come on, TJ, hurry up! It's time to catch the bus, let's go! But, but... Thank goodness that's over, let's get out of here. But Mikey, this Rogan guy invented Senior Fusion! That's nothing, TJ! My guy worked at Los Alamos. He actually had access to test sites? Well, my lady's teaching me a thing or two about dealing with Southpaws! Come on, guys, the bus is here! We don't want to miss the fest! But the streak was just about to give me pro base running tips! I'm not going nowhere! Yeah, come on, Mikey, we're going back in! No, I won't go back in there! I can't deal with those crazy old folks anymore! Sure you can, Mikey! They're not crazy! They're great! They're booing me! Huh? I expected everyone to be happy just listening to me sing! Instead, all they do is complain about the songs I'm singing! Well, did you ask them what songs they'd like to hear? Uh, no. Well, maybe if you listen to what they're saying, you learn some neat stuff and make a few new friends. Sure worked that way for all of us. Gee, I guess I wasn't thinking about it like that, TJ. Up for giving it another shot? Why, yes. I think I am. Hello again, ladies. Well, looky here. Big boy's back. I'll now be taking requests. Oh, now that's more like it. You were singing stuff my mother listened to. How about Raul and the gang? <laughs> or maybe Johnny Velvet? Oh, yeah, that cat really swings. Here, boy, I'll try this one. Que simpatico means I think you're fine. Que simpatico because you're divine. Let me tell you now, sometimes I just have to shout, Que simpatico, let my feelings ride out, Que simpatico, you are without a doubt, Que simpatico, I'm so glad you're mine.